First London Route PR1. 2. LVAG's YouTube channel. Go subscribe. Hey everyone, what is up? Louis Fox in game saying welcome back to another new video on the channel where today we're back in London and A's. It's been a while since, but we're back in it. And this time we're going to be taking a Rustle Boston Fire 400 MMC, the blue livery this time. Yep, the livery is different. On the X20 from Walthamstow Central to Woodford Green. And if we got time at the end, we could also make a return journey as well. Anyways, let's jump in, set our route, and get the passengers on board. I think this guy is waiting for me as well. Let's get on. Right, so we are in and we'll pull up to our stand first and then we will set our route, uh, which we'll be doing the X20. Uh, so we'll just go around to the other side of Walthamstow and find our stand. Uh, and then we will begin our route X20 towards Woodford Green. Up ahead, stop in here. There we go. And we'll set route X20, now boarding at Walthamstow Central. Uh, all right, then let's get the passengers on board. I think there's a few people waiting for me already, by the looks of it. Two army mans got on. Another passenger got on as well, taking the rinse screen view right there. So, one thing I do want to say that I do apologise for not uploading as much London East videos, because the game is just slowly dying a little bit. It's not receiving as much updates. Uh, and the game has been missing a lot of futures ever since. Uh, um, the reason why the game has not received as much updates as it used to have is because um, the creator of this game, LD, is currently working on a new boss simulator game on Birmingham City Centre. Yeah, he is actually making a boss simulator based off my local city. I, this is going to be very exciting. It's still in development, but hopefully it'll be released soon. And I will try to do a video on it if I've got the chance. Shut up back there. So, yeah, we think we'll get going now. We'll close the doors. We'll now head our way to Woodford Green. So, there's been a few sneak peeks of the new Project Birmingham that is currently in development right now. Uh, um, I'm not sure when it's going to be released, but LD will tell us eventually. And I think they will open up a testing game first to check if, if any bugs are still in the game. And if it's all good then we'll release it to the public and then everyone can have the chance to play it uh, it's a very exciting moment this is uh, seeing a new boss simulator game coming out very soon uh, which is based off my local city i'm looking forward to driving national express west midland buses around my city and i'm always curious what routes they're going to be adding in that game uh, and also another game that used to be a thing, Southgate and Countryside Bus Simulator. If you remember that game that LD brought, uh, that is no longer a thing now. The game is now set to private. It's now locked. You cannot play it anymore. I don't know why, though. It was a nice little bus simulator game that was only out temporarily. But it's probably not receiving as much as it is. So it's probably a good reason why to close it down. So we are going to continue our way now over to Woodford Green. Um, this is a different bus as we're expecting. Rustall bus in 5400 MMC. So last time I drove in the, the 25X branding livery from Stratford over to Lee Valley. So I thought I'd do a different video on a different livery for this selected bus. And there's this 20 over here might be going the wrong way. Or is it just not in surface following this bus for the sake of it? Because it looks pretty. Anyways, let's continue down here. And we did this route before on the Transbus Enviro 300 towards Woodford Green from Walthamstow and then a Enviro 200 MMC from Woodford Green back to Walthamstow. The, I thought I would do the X20 again because it's one of my favourite routes to drive in the game. Uh, yeah, because I do like a bit of fast routes in my honest opinion. And that's just something I like about it. From Walthamstow to Woodford you go via these main roads and then you jump onto the expressway. Uh, and then you get to the new Woodford Greens area. And we are not far far off now until we reach the roundabout where we're about to jump onto the expressway where we can have the chance to check out this bus's top speed. Uh, which, for real, it go it does go faster than the actual Rustle Bus X25 brand in, uh, which is one good thing about this. Uh, at least it's a faster bus. Uh, and I'm just not sure if it, it's a... Um, and a newer generation of the Rustle Bus in 5400 MMC. Or because I think in that last one I drove might be an older variant of it. And there's also a first urban livery. Is it really? No, first Olympia livery for the 5400 MMC as well. In the last bus livery, which I could drive eventually. But routes are really starting to fall apart. Because recently we had two routes removed from this game. 
Now I'll have a look here while we're here. They actually got rid of the root P and C. It's one of those Higham Hill routes that used to go from Higham Hill to Yardley Lane and Chingford Hatch. So the root P goes from Higham Hill to Yardley Lane via Chingford Hall Estate and Chingford Hatch. Uh, Yardley Lane, yeah, that's where it terminated. And then Route C went from Higham Hill to Chingford Hatch going via Crooked Billet and Higham's Park Station. I don't know why they got rid of those routes. There was a nice addition, in my honest opinion, to the custom companies list. Uh, so now that we're on the motorway now, we can get this chance to pick up this bus's top speed. And it goes a top speed of 67 miles per hour down the expressway. I can see all the buses going way slow back there. I don't know why I'm, I'm starting to lag a little bit. I was going to go back in the cab for a bit. When we get off this expressway, I don't know why I'm lagging a bit. This is the problem with most other Roblox transport games. Uh, don't know why it always does this. It's ridiculous. Uh, games lag. Sometimes it crashes for absolutely purposely stupid reasons. Like, for example, for example, if you're recording a long journey and then the game crashes when you get to the very end uh, and you had all those people on the bus, uh, you got disconnected. And then everyone left again because they've been wondering where you've gone. So we got some AI passengers that we could stop for. We'll stop here for the other guys to pick up. Uh, yep, yeah, I can see Ninja in there on the X20 to Woodford Green in that Urban 2. And then there's a stagecoach bus behind me. I don't know what he's doing behind my back. And I should have known it was a bacon following me this entire time. Why did I not notice that? Uh, but we are now on this um, home stretch now until we get to Woodford Green. And if we got time at the end, we could do a return journey to Walthamstow. Because this route is not really that long. Uh, well, the, the normal 20 goes via Whips Cross. Uh, and this goes via an expressway. It's quicker on the X20. Yeah? As the 20 goes via more like urban areas of the route it is going towards. Uh, so this must be where we're near Woodford Green now. So we'll terminate, head over to the other bus stop, get the passengers picked up if anyone's going to go there. Not sure what the chat is like, but we'll have a look. Ah, nothing much. But we are just about to approach our terminus now at Woodford Green. Um, screw the red light. Uh, we'll make a right. My man just went the wrong way. Lol, lol, lol. Um, we'll go to the other bus stop on the opposite side. We won't terminate there. So, the next bus stop up ahead, uh, when we get to it, uh, we'll have a nearby spawn that people can get on the bus from there. So, we'll just make a little turn around here, then hopefully we'll have more passengers get on, and then we'll return to Walthamstow Central. Uh, it's just depending on how many passengers are there at the moment, because uh, I still only have one passenger on me who's sitting at the windscreen seat. Uh, well, it turns out we actually have someone here, so we'll stop here. And we'll change our route around. So that's our first part of the route completed. Got a few passengers about to come on the bus as well. Right, so um, this guy back here is trying to find his parking space. But just park in the 20s while that stagecoach of 504 back there has no idea where he's at. Uh, he's followed us because he's curious where this certain location might be at. Uh, so how many passengers are getting on the moment? We saw two people get on. One Punch and NR Head in the LVAG merch, which is a nice addition. So I don't know what this man's doing back here. If you're gonna stay on, get off. If you fancy a bit of just flossing. Okay, well, sure, I guess. And okay, nice backflip right there. That is clever. Um, looks like I'm getting Daniel on board. Is that the same face? Oh, of course it would have been, but it's a different clothes. You never expect me with that type of clothes before. I've never seen anyone with that before. Was not expecting it. Uh, the boss livery matches you. Uh, well, the blue is front, um, dark blue at the back. Yeah, you could say it kind of fits it with the uh, type of clothes I'm wearing and the livery itself, but not that yellow line, no. Uh, doesn't have that colour on my lightning bolt on me. It would be light blue. So, not to worry, it is fine. But we are going to be departing now. I forgot to set my route while I'm here. We'll head back to Walthamstow now. We'll collect the doors closed in. I think one of the Canterbury administrators were too late to board the bus. No other words apart from that. We are now departing Woodford Green. And now let's return back to Walthamstow Central. Uh, yeah, this guy is upon it at the same time. We could get a screenshot while we're there as well. Uh, I might edit that out while I'm there. So let's continue our way out of Woodford Green now. We'll 
hop on a quick ride back to Walthamstow Central. You can pick up the AIs while you're here. I'll just continue along. And we'll take the exit up here. We'll make a right. And then we will take the exit back on to the, um, the junction for the highway. And now we can pick up some speed down this um, straight road while we're here. Since there is no one going to be messing around on this particular road. Going 67 miles per hour down this road. Don't know why I'm even lagging. What the hell's going on? It really shouldn't be doing that. Uh, this is the problem with most other Roblox games. Uh, like sometimes the game just takes too long to even load in stuff. And you could accidentally fall out of the map any time. Uh, okay, stop, 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 stop. Jesus Christ. I don't know what even is going on anymore. But we got some passengers that we could pick up here. I haven't seen myself yet in the Compass merch. Uh, which I really should have changed my avatar before I was even added onto this game. Where did you come out of, you silly bacon? Get in front. Uh, try and figure out where you're going, man. Because uh, I'm thinking this guy's going to take a wrong turn in. What is this man even doing? Uh, yeah, it's definitely a bacon by the looks of it. Uh, he's trying to cut me off by the looks of it. Is he going to run that red light? Wow. Surprisingly, the bacon is actually stopping getting the red light. What a surprise that is. I normally see most Bacons just run a red light. Uh, but I'm surprised that this one didn't. Uh, I'm quite surprised, not going to lie. Uh, I can see a few people beeping back there. There's an MMC right there. Just came off the expressway by the looks of it. Uh, is that going towards Leightonstone or something? Uh, it's probably going to go straight on. Yeah, it's probably going towards Whips Cross that direction. Uh, We've got a red here, and then we will jump back onto the expressway in just a moment. And my man right here just, wow, overran that red light by a lot right there. Just continue. And uh, don't just reverse, just because, oh my god, it's a green light. Just get a move on, man. Oh, well, I'll just go in front. So the stagecoach bus behind, know where he's about to go. Uh, so let's get back on this expressway now. Uh, going at the main highway speed at 67 miles per hour. Go in the cab for a bit, because why not? Uh, just let go of the pedal right there. And we're now going about 70 miles per hour. Still bloody lagging somehow. Don't ask why I'm even doing that. Uh, and soon we will make it back to Walthamstow in just a few moments. With two buses behind our back. Uh, so we're just going to get off this expressway now. About to exit off at this junction. And this will lead us over towards Walthamstow Central when we take the first exit. And by the looks of it, while I'm lagging, I can see that my bus is about to screw up its controls big time right there. Nice Italo back there. So where's the other buses? The stagecoach one is about to come up. Oh my god, let go of that. Uh, the bacon catched up by a lot there. And there comes Lemonade. Uh, okay, Ninja 991. Uh, and we're now back onto this main road. Uh, I'm quite surprised how this um, limited stop route does not serve any of the bus stops between that last junction at Woodford towards Walthamstow. It's absolutely non-stop all the way. You don't stop at any of these bus stops. And even if someone is there, you cannot stop for them on this particular route. Or you could, but that's basically what the game is, in my honest opinion. You have a certain amount of routes, stop at a Pacific bus stop location, uh, and then you're off. Uh, it's just a different, different bus route, stop at alternative stops as we go along. Uh, so, where's the other people behind you guys catched up a lot right there? I can see a lot back there. So, uh, just about a minute away from Witch and Wolfenstow, where we will be finishing off today's video there. We'll go straight on. Don't have to worry about the screen light right here, because good thing it's not red. And looks like we got a bus blocking the road right here. What's going on, man? Your average stagecoach driver has crashed into a car. I don't know how someone managed to do that. Like, I have seen better days. Uh, I might have to give a driver of the day award to that one person who just crashed. Uh, but he couldn't get out, so he just despawned. Because uh, I was just about to give him a medal for it. And whoever was driving that bus and you're watching this video right now, I give you the biggest medal of your life. The biggest reward of your life is a massive trophy for the worst driver ever. Oh my god, I am over the moon because of that. Uh, anyways, I can just see Wolfenstow on the right-hand side. Uh, so we'll make this right here. Then we'll make another right into the bus station. And that is where we're going to be finishing our route here. And here we are back at Wolfenstow. We'll terminate at this stand over here. And we'll stop here. There we go. Open the doors. 
And we have finished our root fish show for today, guys. So that was the X20 in the Rostock Boss in 400 MMC from Wolfhamstow Central to Woodford Green and then making the return journey back to Wolfhamstow. Like, what a good run that was. So since that we are finished, guys, we're going to be leaving today's video here. I just want to say thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you all did enjoy. If you want to see more videos like this one, make sure to like, comment, share and subscribe for more videos. Oh, God, there goes my boss. Let's not talk about that. Until next time, guys, we'll see you all in the next one. Bye, guys. See ya.